Uh, Deshaun, what, what are you looking to prove out here today? I think I didn't play to my full potential last time I was at the Chicago camp. So right this year, this at this camp, I have no friends. I'm not talking to nobody. Who wants to show your business? Now spring ball's over for y'all, right? Oh, uh, we don't have spring ball in Minnesota, so. Oh, oh, that's right. Okay. Yeah. What uh, what part of your game have you really been working on uh, the uh, most? For the past month, I've been running, just getting my my stamina back up. So I, next year I'll be able to play the whole game, no problem. Looks like you trimmed down a little bit. Is that something you've been trying to yeah, do? Yeah. Last last time I was down, I was probably like 275. So I'm now I'm back down to 260. Pretty cool. Notre Dame's one of the big players for you, man. I know that they, you know, there's a there's a pipeline with your school there. Um, talk about the next time you're going to be up at Notre Dame. Um, I think in the next three weeks I'll probably be down. When I take the sound mind, sound body trip, I'll probably drive down and take a Notre Dame trip. Okay. And they have the Irish Invasion on the 20th. Are you are you trying to yeah, go to that? Yeah, I'm trying to do that. It just depends on if I have time because Penn State has a barbecue and I haven't been to Penn State yet. So yeah. it's just... Which one wants to go to? Okay, and then with with their pitch to you now, they've been recruiting you so long. What are they telling you? I mean, what are the conversations that you have right now with you know Elson, Van Gorder, things like that? Well, Elson, I'm doing a relationship right here, right right now, and it's on. It's going. It's becoming a good, really good relationship. And Coach Kelly calls me like a couple days ago, and I was talking to him on the phone for about 30 minutes. So the relationship at Notre Dame is, is building right now. Deshaun, you have so many schools that are involved in your recruitment. It seems like you know you, you've changed leaders a couple of times, and, and you you really like a lot of different schools. Yeah. Yeah. You named Michigan State a couple of weeks ago. Is, is that still the case? Are they still on top for you? I had that visit at Ohio State yesterday. It's one of my best visits yet. So I, at this point, it's Ohio State, Michigan, Michigan State, Penn State. It's, it's all in the mix right now. So you have more of like a top group than a, you know, yeah. just a, a total leader. What, what's the one or two factors that's really going to put a school over the top for you? Um, academics and having me be able to come early, early in play. It's like I won't get on the field as soon as possible, and I want to come come play for spring ball. So now those schools run some different defenses. Some of them run kind of more the three-four, some of them more the four-three. What what do you see yourself as? Do you want to be a three-four defensive end, a four-three defensive end? Uh, at this point, it, it doesn't. Matter. I just want to get on the field. It doesn't matter what position I play. I play special teams. I just want to get on the field for some time. Sure. Have, have you had a chance to talk to Van Gorder much since he came over from when Diaco was there at Notre Dame? Um, not not really, but because the only two recruiting coaches I've been talking to is Elston and Coach Kelly, but I think I'm going to, when I go down to Notre Dame, well, I'll, you get I'll, up get there. Chance, I'll get a chance to talk to him. And what was your current height and weight? You know? um, 6'3", 260. What, uh, what, what coach would you say, I mean, outside of Notre Dame, obviously, since you just talked about them, that you have the best relationship with? I think Larry Johnson from my own state, or Sean Spencer from – or chaos, kind of chaos <laughs> from Penn State. Them two, right now, I have, a, I have a great relationship with. How are their styles of recruiting different? Um, I think when them, with them calling me or just hitting me on Twitter like every day, it's just checking up on me, see how I'm doing. It's just, it feels like family, and it's like they're caring, they care about you. Is your commitment date still the same, the uh, yeah, first August, game of the year? August 28th, yeah. All right, thanks, how, Sean. how important is it to, to come out here and, and get that ticket, man, and, and it, get open, it's, as it's they really say? It's important to me. I got the five-star challenge, and I just want to get this Nike open and challenge.